our uh, CEO uh, there, Sokala, and uh, Nicolas Chavert, President of uh, Sokata North America, that will be our speaker this afternoon. Thank you. I can tell you that I'm extremely glad to be here at Oshkosh for what is in fact the, the ultimate aviation event in the world. And I'm especially glad because I missed a few of them uh, because of other duty uh, the past four years. I'm also very glad because this is, of course, as Philip said, a special event where we are not celebrating the end of a century, but the start of a new one that we are going to, uh, to have in 44 minutes now. So if, I, if we are too long, just tell us and we stop to speak and do the countdown. I'm also very glad because I was able to fly the, the TBM, this one, the, the special TBM that I brought from Florida, where we are located in the United States. And I flew yesterday in a very nice flight with a nice aircraft, with a special registration that you can see on the picture. It's registered November 1911, also to celebrate the first year where uh, this company was born. In the long-term strategy, we are and we want to remain an aircraft manufacturer, which is obvious from the aircraft manufacturing business standpoint. Uh, we are here for 100 years. We are going to stay in business for the next 100 years, at least, beside the TBM to bring to the market another product. We have a code name within the company called NTX, which is basically a, a new aircraft a twin engine with the number of seats which is not yet defined. There is more to come for this celebration this week in Oshkosh, but I will give the mic to Nicolas to explain the update of the TBM program and the key events of this week. Thank you for your attention. Thank you, Stefan. Let me uh, bring you up to date with a couple of uh, news on the TBM program. Uh, we have delivered more than 244 aircraft this week. We are expecting to deliver the uh, 235th aircraft. Uh, with all of the orders that uh, we have uh, booked, we have about a year of production ahead of us. Uh, this is obviously a continuous success in this uh, field with uh, the TBM 850, which, uh, if we continue this rate in less than two years, would be above the figures of the TBM 700. But we have uh, gone our way out to make sure that the support which I've been telling you about uh, many times is continuing to take effect at Sukala. One of the things that we did offer this year, which is uh, again uh, making the uh, aircraft exceptional, is that we have a complete extended maintenance package which is offered for the first five years of the aircraft. Here. Let me tell you before he's getting uh, to tell you more about his trip. He was the first one to land a GA, so a general aviation aircraft in Beijing. So for that, I think we need to have a big round of applause to you. Wait a couple of words about your trip, your experience. Um, thank you, Victor. Um, the one thing I'd say is uh, <clears throat> a TBM I'm flying is uh, 20 year old but it performs exactly like the brand new one. So the whole trip, and uh, that demonstrated quality. And then when I bought a new one, the more guaranteed, but after 20 years of in service, had a 3, 000, over 3,000 hours, but flying the whole trip without a glitch, it's impressive. So I appreciate it for, for uh, being able to fly the TBM around the world. And the landing in Beijing, it uh, signified the, a milestone for China opening GA airspace. But I knew, and I, I'm very blessed that you have this connection and that you be able to get a flying permit. But one thing I know, if uh, the landing at Beijing is the history milestone in China GA, the TBM is the key to open the GA airspace. So I appreciate the GA, uh, the TBM, to uh, allow me to fly the Airplane that high in the you know route and be able to land with the jet fuel because the Beijing capital doesn't have jet fuel. Thank you, Ray. Um, this countdown started uh, last year in the same place, about the same time, 
and uh, so it was decided because we had a, a lot of work to prepare. Uh, last question before the century: Do you take a trade in not by A50? No. <laughs> <laughs> We are fully, fully ready to discuss that. <laughs> so now we'd like to do the countdown for entering a new century. So if we can have the youngest of the team that will certainly work on new products. 10, 9, 11, no, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, 1. 